What's up, everyone? Shlomo Track, and we're going to Chris Mechanic here. Today, we're going to be talking about HubSpot sequences. Chris has been talking a lot about HubSpot sequences <laughs> around the office recently, saying, like, hey, do you try HubSpot sequences? Mm. So try to say that fast five times. <laughs> Hard to say. But anyway, Chris, can you tell us a little bit about HubSpot sequences and why they're important? Sure. I, I absolutely am in love with HubSpot sequences. If you have a sales team, and they're calling. Like a lot of prospects when they call, they're B2B, a lot of them are SaaS, they have these sales teams that are just call, call, call all, right. all the time. If that's you, you absolutely should leverage HubSpot sequences. What HubSpot sequences is, is a tool that enables you to leverage basically one-to-one -one emailing and mass. And there's a lot of different tools out uh, like that, you know, such as outreach.io is like that. But what's really cool about HubSpot sequences, and, and these tools basically the way that they work, uh, you can you can upload a list or you can target a list and essentially uh, create a sequence of emails to go out to each individual on that list where you can like customize and tweak uh, individual emails slightly. But what's so cool and powerful about having it built on HubSpot is in lieu of like when you're using an outreach, you would grab a static list right. and basically upload it and you can segment based off the parameters that you have. But having it plug right into HubSpot is super powerful because of all the different data that you have access to and what you're able to segment on. So for instance, like right when uh, a lead that visits the website fills out a web form on HubSpot, their data is instantaneously appended with industry, location, uh, Company size, size in right? terms of employees, size in terms of revenue, pages that they've looked at, the traffic source, and all these different things. So as a salesperson, and I know like I've been doing this within our own HubSpot instance, and I know Nicole has been, and I think you have been too. You can basically go spin up a list lightning fast of basically anything that you could dream up and then create a super targeted series of messages. And like what I'll do is I'll enroll, you know, maybe 10 or 20 or 30 individuals per day in these. And then after a week or a month, all of a sudden you have hundreds and hundreds of emails going out per day. Uh, and you get notifications, like when individuals open emails, you can get notifications, or when they click on links within emails, you can get notifications. And uh, the coolest thing about it, not the coolest, but one other cool thing, uh, like whereas in a workflow, if they respond to an email, they would continue getting it. Mm -hmm. They're actually unenrolled when they respond. So you're able to make sure that like if they're responding yeah. and they're interested, then you're not going to hit them up with another call to action or something. Absolutely. Like yeah. So like if I'm, if you have a sales team and they're cold calling, you should totally look into this. It's not expensive to do. It's not difficult. Uh, but after enrolling 20, 30, 50 individuals per day into like an eight part sequence, You'll just have hundreds and hundreds of emails going out, and you'll have people calling you like, "Hey, I got your email. I'm ready for an appointment." Right, it's, right. it's a beautiful thing, man. So that's why that's why right, we're using it. Me, you sold me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna start using it more often. So yeah, if you'd like to All learn right. more about this. Um, or really, if you just have a sales team that needs leads, we've got all types of tools and techniques to help you out. So feel free to give us a shout. All right.